All right, kids. Daddy's got a very, very important meeting that he has to go to, but you guys all get to stay and play a super duper fun game. It's called Your Future Opoly. Okay, sounds like fun, right? Yeah! Pay attention because I'm only going to tell you how to play the rules once. This is how you play the game United States of America, population 310 million people and rising. Currency? Currently? The dollar. $14.26 trillion gross domestic product. Ew! Gross like poo! Ew! Yeah, kind of. See, America is a living, breathing organism. And if we feed it our time and our money and our patience, the GDP, or gross domestic product, is what it poops out. That's not scary. That's a $13.7 trillion public deficit. It's like a big black hole. But don't pay any attention to it or you'll get sucked in, just like Rainbow's parents did. Oh yeah, Rainbow, your parents were factory workers, right? Mm -hmm. Now who here knows what a factory worker used to do? Ooh, ooh, me, me, ooh, ooh, me. Ooh, ooh. I, I know, me. I know. Barry. Oh, yes. A factory worker was somebody who made things that people use, like clothes, cars, toys, radios, and all kinds of stuff. They wore work clothes and got paid by the hour. They worked hard, but they didn't ever get rich. Ever. There used to be tons of them all across the USA, but we're working hard to change that now. That's right. That's exactly right. So Rainbow, uh, unfortunately, you can't play this game. You're just going to have to go home. Okay, Barry, since your father's a good friend of mine, you're gonna go first. Yes! All right. All right. So now, the fun part begins. Simply roll the die, advance your pieces, invest your money, and get rich! Go to college if you want to, but remember, a quick buck is better than... No! Congratulations, get a part-time job at McBurgers. Wow. Collect $50 every turn. That's awesome. You're going to make so much money. Outsource labor to Malaysia saves $130 billion annually and permanently eliminate 250,000 U.S. jobs. Fire all employed players on the board. Can I still play? If you still have money. The Organization of Petroleum Exporting Countries, OPEC, raises oil prices to $185 per barrel. All players must pay Saudi Arabia half their money. Oh, oh no! no! United States large corporations import 1 million containers or $1.4 trillion annually. All players must pay half of their remaining money to foreign manufacturers. The U.S. federal government pays $1 billion toward Gulf oil spill cleanup and 1 million jobs are lost. You must pay the equivalent of a tenth of the richest player's money and the player with the least money is fired. Oh no, that's me, but I was already fired. I don't have enough money. I can't play. Did I overhear that one of you guys can't play? Of course you can. You have to. Okay guys, these are IOUs. They're sort of like debt, except, um, well, they're exactly like debt. So, who's next? But we don't have enough money. 
Well, that's okay. More IOUs. Here. You each are responsible to pay $179,000 to the government of China. So y'all better grow up and get jobs. Oh, hey, darling. Come on over here. You should sign one of these, too. It's, uh, it's pretty standard. You have to.